This is Project Dress for Success, the search for the best way to dress for your job interview. It's cut or it's beat cut. All you gotta do is make it work. Ten possible clothing combinations, but only four of them are acceptable. Business or business casual? What's wrong and what's right? Leadership Walton is here to get you back on track. Can I wear jeans with a sport jacket? I already know this. We're gonna show you the right way to dress for success. Ooh, here comes Connor. I like the Leadership Walton shirt, but I'm really questioning the taste level here, Amanda. Yeah, this is just not good. You can't get into the career fair wearing jeans, and they're definitely not appropriate for a professional interview. Yeah, look at the crowd. They agree this is not good. I just don't get it. If we're talking about professionalism, she really missed the mark on this one. Right? Even for a casual company, you should always present the best version of yourself in an interview. I agree. First impressions matter. Ooh, that's a tough reaction. Yeah, look at the crowd there. Well, Jennifer Quentin does not like that dress for an interview. I think I see what she's going for here, but I'm on the fence. When do you think a look like this would be appropriate? This might be okay for everyday business casual workwear, but black denim is too casual for an interview. Right. Presentation is key here. It could easily borderline on unprofessional if she's not careful. You can see that same reaction in the crowd. It's really mixed. Okay, overall this is a good casual outfit. I just wish it was elevated a little more. Not every interview calls for you to be dressed in a suit, so this could be a nice alternative. I like that he wore a belt and dress shoes to make the outfit a little more professional. I agree, and so does the crowd. Overall, this is great. Casual, but still professional. He looks sharp and really working the crowd here, but a tie would really pull this together if he's gonna head into an interview. I agree. It is always good to put your best foot forward at a career fair or in an interview. And here comes Miriam. If she's going for business casual, this is a great look. I agree. You could get away with this at an interview, but a jacket would really put it over the top. And it's always a good idea to be business professional at the career fair. Those are some really positive reactions we're seeing here. That's right. Miriam is back and this is what we have been waiting to see. Excellent. Yes, I like to see this shirt tucked in, a nice jacket, her hair pulled back and out of her face. The details really make this outfit business professional. I really like this look. Clean, classic, professional. Exactly what we like to see at the career fair. That's right, you can't go wrong with a suit and tie. He's also ready for any interview. And the crowd is loving it. Okay, Amanda, what did we learn here today? Well, JR, I learned if you can wear it to the gym, you shouldn't wear it to an interview, and certainly not the career fair. Even jeans are a little bit too casual. What do you think would be better? We want to see our students at the career fair dress business professional. We've seen some borderline outfits here today, but I think Walton students know what business professional now looks like. Yeah, those details really put an outfit over the edge. And if you need help putting one together, you can always visit the Walton Career Closet. And that will do it for this episode of Dress for Success.